I have been going here for four years, and I have not had the lead in a single play. It's just unfair. Oh well, well maybe I haven't had the leads, but I have had all the important parts. The big sound of music, auditions had come. I sang both my songs, had them under my thumb. I told them I had my heart set on Maria. If I got the Baroness, I might say Sia. Soon up went the list on the call board upstairs. I looked for my name and I saw it right there. It said nun number seven. <laughs> nun number seven? Really? <laughs> I went to the library, studied the score. I found my three lines, couldn't find any more. Then I realized the Nazi's black car represents the whole theme of deceit. Then the story gets tense. This car is what they must drive off in the end. And this is significant. No one befriends them. The jokes are What's that? Who's she? It's all about me. Oh. In fall, I got brave and auditioned again for stage adaptation of Gone with the Wind. I told them how naturally a Southern I am. They said, my dear, frankly, we don't give a damn. But we do need a girl to wear blackface and play in a walk on as Scarlet's young midwife and slave help birth in her babies. I don't know nothing about birth and no babies. Well, mad as I was, I perused through the script. I was thinking that once again I had been gypped. Then I realized the one thing I hadn't before Their child was symbolic of the whole civil war Her birth was the birth of the southern plantation And when she falls off her horse so does the nation The kid would have never been born They didn't have me So who's Miss O'Hara? Who cares about Tara? What's that? Who's she? What's a whorehouse with no whore? I wore pants in our town and played the town drunk Without me that boring old play, what a stunk! Then next I played Lady Macbeth's youngest daughter If she hadn't died, maybe I would have shot her! I tried out for Mousetrap, they made me the mouse In Wizard of Oz I played What's that? Who's she?